Hello, this is Glenda with Fraylins and Friends Crafts Plus. Tonight I'm just gonna tell you about my day. It was eventful. Okay, I started. <laughs> I woke up with a heck of a pain in the mid between my shoulder blades. Oh, you ever get that? I mean, I had it the other day and I told myself I was not gonna bend over and pop my back. I gave in. I bent over and popped my back last night. It popped a couple times. This morning I woke up. Ah, oh, it almost hurt to breathe. And you know I need that. So, I took some, some my morning meds and I knocked out for the morning. And this afternoon, we had to go to the doctor. So, we tanked me up with my oxygen tank. Don't get the wrong idea. My portable. <laughs> After I took a shower and I uh, didn't shave, unfortunately. Sorry, guys. <laughs> TMI. Mm. And I did manage, I, uh, my back was not terrible then. It wasn't great, but it wasn't terrible. I did take more Tylenol and that helped. So got in the car and drove to the doctor's office and I did manage to walk it. So I must not have been doing too bad. Didn't need to borrow a wheelchair, nothing. Just walked the whole thing. It's not that big of an office. I'm still going. I'm still going. Saw the nurse. First thing, of course, you get weighed. I lost two pounds, which I just gained back eating a brownie. That's my brownie point for the day. Okay, uh, she also did my blood pressure and all that. It was great. No, honestly, it was great. <laughs> my blood pressure, my temperature, and everything on that score was great. So, and Joe was with me, so he had to go through all this too, which was... <laughs> <laughs> But he didn't have any problems either, so. <laughs> then Vampira came out. Stuck me right there. Right there. But it was a very small. <laughs> she uses a nice little needle and it flows a little slower, but, or fills the, the thing a little slower, but. It isn't as big an owie. So we got that done. So they'll be doing blood work. We told them, no, don't do you any good to do any kind of fasting blood work because nobody told us to fast. We didn't fast. I know I didn't. <laughs> so they took that in stride. I don't think they expected it because they never said anything about it. Then we got our flu shots. Yay, us! Yes, we did. We got our flu shots and we are fine. And we discussed other things like medication, our age. Yeah, we're getting to that point where our doctor's talking about our age. And here, he and Joe share some arthritis in common. Something about right in here. And so they were having a nice little chat about their common problem of arthritic thumb. And it does make it very hard for them to open a package of cheese, according to the doctor. <laughs> I hope he doesn't listen to this. If he does, Don, I'm sorry, I'm funning. So have a laugh. 
<laughs> uh, anyway, no, it actually has been a pretty good day. My back is a little bit, mm, yeah, but it's not like this morning. This morning, oh man, it was awful. But I also took a couple of gas relief tablets because I've been doing a lot of belching. I don't know, that might have had something to do with it. It can. It can. Huh, so that's the report from... <laughs> that's the health report from today. I just felt a twinge. I twisted this way a little. All I felt was a tiny twinge, but I know not to go any further. I'm just being... Well, I'm being truthful, but silly about it. Not nothing, nothing else I can do. And nothing was really that bad. <laughs> she was very nice about the flu shot. It went in and that was it. She took out the needle and that was it. Flea bite. No, that would itch. Don't want fleas. Uh, prickly thorn. I don't know what it was. It was a needle. It was a needle. But it wasn't a bad one. So, then we left, and as we were driving downtown, well, there's this house that should have been, the city should have insisted on somebody tearing it down years ago. I've shown you the one across the street. It's worse, much worse. This one has got the roof has fallen in, the porch roof on it is hanging off, and the house is actually open to the elements because the side of it's knocked out. It's a danger. It's pure danger. And it doesn't even have any kind of tape around it or nothing. And I can't go tear it down. Somebody's going to have to. Unfortunately, nobody has to, so they don't. Until somebody gets in trouble with a financial situation because someone got hurt. I have a feeling that by now, probably hasn't had pet taxes paid on it forever. So it probably belongs to the county or something. I don't know. I don't think it's ever been, I don't know if it's ever been put up on a sheriff's auction or not. I just don't know. And the one across the street that I always complain about, not for a while, it's part of a corporation. The corporation better get themselves in gear before somebody gets hurt because they are liable. Um, let's see. Oh, and we passed by a little park that I keep wanting to stop at. But I didn't take my camera today, so we didn't stop at it. It's right down in the middle of the town. And it's a the it's about the Burlington Northern Railroad that it has a miniature of the depot that was here in town. This I don't know, it has a history to it, and I would have to not well, the Burlington Northern. The park is what, you know, honors that part of the town. This used to be, in the late 1800s, it was a railroad boomtown. And it was a shock to Chicago. <laughs> Some called it Little Chicago. There were a few bootleggers around. <laughs> but it wasn't just this town. And that's a whole different story. And I'm not going to tell it today. <laughs> so I will talk to you. Ah, let's see, Monday. And do whatever you want with the little pauses that are in here. <laughs> Take them for effect. Who used to do that? <laughs> Was it perhaps Alfred Hitchcock? He would talk. Only he had a much growlier intake of breath. 
He was a funny guy. Even if he made horror movies, he was a funny guy. Well, I've talked about everything under the sun. Not quite. But I've spoken about a few things about the day. So that's it. <laughs> I'm done. I'll see you Monday. In the pictures. Your pictures that you put on your thing. You know what I mean. I love you. Please smile and wave. And, yeah, smile, I see. Smile away. And give me a thumbs up, please. And subscribe and click that ding a ding a bell, the notification bell. That's what I mean. We'll see you. Love you. Night, night. <laughs>